Hello and welcome. If you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel. Hit that notification bell to all so you'll always get updates when new videos are posted. As you can see here, I have a pink and a light pink stitching with a white fill in. And I did an old school stitching, which I call old school because I did it when I was younger. But um, you just basically do um, rows of five and then you go all the way across and then every three you loop it in and out and then it looks like this on the back. And then I went on and completed the next row. Then I decided to outline the larger flower, heart, clover, with a pink, as you can see here, as you can see here. So it's basically four hearts that meet in the center. And then I outlined them in pink. And then I did the pink trim on the part. This is the tissue part where the tissues go in. And then this is the part where you can put your remote, your change, your keys, whatever, by your dresser or desk. Or if you have an office, you can put your pens and pencils and scissors in it. And it also has hearts. And it will also be filled in with the um, either A, the white or light pink. I don't know. Do I want to continue? You know, do I want to put the white in here? Kind of like, you know, um, let's see. We can kind of like compare it a little bit. You know, do I want the white on the white like that? Because that's how it would be. So I don't know if I want to do that or the light pink. And then, of course, there is the other side. So basically, if I can do it without, let's see. Let's try to use some string here. So this would be the inside of the tissue box here. And then of course this would be the front side of the tissue box. And then of course the front um, right here would be where the little pocket would be. So it would look like this when it's sitting up. So I don't know if that's very good visual for you to compare <laughs> what it would look like, but and it's kind of a pink color, a light pink color. I wish I knew what I did with the label. But this color is so pretty, and I thought it'd be so cute with this. So I'm making this for a girl. Um, I don't know anyone that has a girl yet, but I want to go ahead and make one for a girl. And if you notice, it is dirty, because I've been taking it with me when I go places. So, um, and like, see here? But that's okay. All you do is put a little, little small splot in your hand, get it wet, and then just kind of Wow, my hands look weird in this light. And rub it, you know, on it. And then you just rinse it off, set it outside in the sun, let it dry, and then it's perfectly fine. But use very little soap and just kind of, you know, rub the spots that are bad and just wipe it over. That is weird. Makes my, my hands look weird. Um, I'm using a different lighting and I don't think I like it. But anyway, I just wanted to show you this cute design that I'm working on um, for a girl. So if you are looking for a cute design for a girl... This would be cute. And you could even put like their little things for their nose and their clippers and their desitin and their little lotion. So you could put things in this and you don't even have to make the top a tissue box. So you could make this part a big box and this one a smaller box. So for bigger things, you can put shampoos and conditioners in this side and then just make the whole bottom solid and it will look really, really cute for a baby girl. So that's, that's one of the parts that I'm working on now. So I hope you enjoyed this little short, quick video. And if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, please leave them in the comment section below. And I look forward to seeing you in my next video. Thank you and have a blessed day.